We are the Father. Brian, Serena, Cameron, Kendall, and Savannah. We're a family of five driven by purpose and fueled by love. We decided to trade in the traditional school life for a life where every day is an adventure of faith and love. From a small photography business grew a love of memory keeping and filmmaking that turned into a full-blown dream of becoming a family of filmmakers exploring the truth about education. So we're learning to document our adventures in homeschool, business, and life and tell stories of how we live and what we learn. And this time it's just us headed to a destination that was the perfect choice for this very moment in our lives. A place where there's constant reminders all around from a culture who believes wholeheartedly in don't worry, take your time, and no rush. Friends, say no more. Let me try and tell you the story of our very first time in Montego Bay, Jamaica. Boom. There you go. We made it. We made it. little chain to put around my mask so that I won't lose it and I'm still leaving it back I'm taking off but people want to get out and see the place <laughs> it is six o'clock we are just now getting out the room I done lost a day wow that's that's really <laughs> you're being really extra right now Why did the cricket sound different? I don't think it was cricket. <laughs> <laughs> They're not crickets, what are they? We're in Jamaica. <laughs> it is our second day here. Yesterday was our travel day. And now today we booked um, rafting down the Martha Bray River. And we're going to go snorkeling in the morning. I wanted to go out on the Luminous Lagoon, but um, I think we're deciding not to do that this time around. Yesterday was my first time having oxtail. That was really yummy. What else did I have? I had um, ackee and saltfish. That was okay. I liked that. I wasn't mad at it. Um, we had some really good plantains, which are one of my favorites. And what else did we do? Yeah, we just relaxed. Just really, really trying to calm my mind <laughs> and enjoy ourselves. So, my boo is out by the water. Surprisingly, we haven't gotten in the water just yet. So, hopefully, we'll do that soon. I have my books. I got my Simply Grateful journal that I got for Teacher Appreciation Week. Reading with the fire on high, finally. I get to read 
by the water. We found the jerk chicken, man. Brian's very happy. We've been given pretty big dreams for our family and the mark that we're meant to make on the world of education. It's often tempting to choose hustle, to attempt to press toward the vision in our own strength and without the grace that's required to see any of this through. This trip immediately reminded us and our troubled hearts to cast every little bit of those cares over to him because he cares, period. Wednesday morning and today is our day for activities so we're going to be heading to the Martha Bray River. We also have our COVID test uh, that we have to get done today. Um, you take your COVID test 72 hours before the date of your departure so we went ahead and went for today so we're going to go have some breakfast, um, go get our test done so that that is out of the way. And then we're going to come back and get ourselves ready so we can meet them at the bus to head over to to head over to the tour so i'm excited about it i heard it's nice and relaxing i think we're also going to be going parasailing either that or what else you want parasailing? yeah Bye. are we going parasailing <laughs> but we won't do that today we'll do that tomorrow i really wanted to go to the luminous lagoon but we'll probably have to do that the next time around feel the sunshine get some breakfast and get the day started I feel like I haven't really vlogged. I'm trying to figure it out. So, we're gonna go. We are on the way to the Martha Bray River. Brian and I just tried to take some selfies. We feel like our selfie game is... It's getting better. It's not good. <laughs> it's getting better. It was trash before, it's getting better. Yeah, it's just not good. So we're trying to work on that. We just figured out what side is the best side. Do y'all have a good side? I like being on this side of him instead of the other side of him. So anyway, we're getting better. Um, Kendall just sent us a text message and said he was jealous that we didn't take him with us. So we were feeling bad. We've been trying to send him pictures, but I think that's back backfiring. Yeah, I brought my hat along. It's designated <laughs> gear holder and I'm excited. So this is kind of the only activity that we booked with the exception of parasailing. So I think we are going to parasail. Yeah, we'll do how to do that tomorrow. You having a good time? I'm having a great time. A great, great time. time. Great I've always time. wanted to come to Jamaica. And yes. Serena did not want to come to Jamaica. It's not on the top of my list. But we're definitely going to come back. <laughs> yeah, so that's what we're doing. I've got on a little leopard print today, friends. We still do have sugar plantation here. From the sugar cane, you'll get sugar, vinegar, molasses, rum. Woo! 
Albania, West Coast, one touch me. <gasps> Sensitive memos. Some Sensitive people call it memo. touch me not. Touch me not. Look at the slavery days. That's what they used to do. Drop the slaves. When the slaves would run away, they would see where they did not be drop. No preservative. Thank you. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah. Mm. The best water. So you drink this every day? No, when I see my skin color, yes. it's a joy. When you yeah. go and you learn other people's culture. Full joy. A full joy. Yeah. Full, full, full joy. joy. Yeah. Yeah, man. It's a joy in my, in my heart, man. Yeah. All right, friends. We're heading out to dinner. And I never really show my outfits when we leave for dinner. Um, but I like this one. We have two more nights left, including tonight. It's a cute little, very comfortable dress with my little lemon bag. And let me show you my earrings. Really super cute. Um, I guess little orange drop earrings. How cute are they? <laughs> so I'm feeling really tropical. I just took a nap. Brian went out and flew the drone and um, got in the water while I got some rest. So now I'm nice and rested. I have a little bit of a headache, which I took some medicine for. And I think it's because I waited so long to eat. It was a long day, friends. I thought it was super cute. So I'm sure Brian is waiting on me. So let's go, friends. You said you was ready 30 minutes ago. I did. So, so why are you always lying? Brian. So Brian's matching me. He's got his little tropical leaves on we're coordinating brian doesn't like coordinating <laughs> but you look nice all right let's go Conversation, no small talk. I, I I small talk. You're getting better. I am. You're getting better. She would prefer deep conversation though, like deep, meaningful purpose. <laughs> How do we change the world? Type of conversation. Solve, solve world hunger <laughs> conversations. That's world her. peace. Yeah, that's her thing. Okay, so I have a question, friends. Don't you think it's just a given for your purposes to be attached to one another? No, not if you marry the wrong person. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> But we didn't marry the wrong people. But I'm just saying. So assuming that's that you're married assumption. to the right person, don't you feel like well, your you're... purposes are aligned and attached? Some people hate each other, but I mean, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, that's not the assumption we're making. Okay, but okay, we have to, we have to say that. So, uh, I mean. Okay, we're not assuming that people hate each other. We are. No. They're they're aligned. <laughs> Trying to soak in as much of 
the trees and the ocean and all of those things with my boo. Um, I did bring my tripod, but only the short one. Friend has her super flowy cover up, feeling really tropical. This is a mango tree. I've been using my plant identification app. So every plant that I come upon that I'm trying to figure out what it is and what it's growing, I take a picture and it tells me what it is. But like us homeschoolers, vacation different, okay? We travel different. <laughs> we ask a whole bunch of questions. Um, I took a guide yesterday. I asked him a whole lot of questions and took notes and everything, friends. So fun fact, whenever you wanna take notes, Without taking notes, I always turn my voice memos on. That way I don't miss anything. Um, or no, I do like voice memos. You're out here recording people when I don't know? It's not illegal. Brian, they're sharing public information. It's not personal stuff. They're telling you like facts about Jamaica and stuff like okay. that. That's not illegal. I turn my voice memos on or voice to text and that will help me make sure I don't miss anything. But yeah, yeah. they gave some good information <laughs> and, how they, and how they got their freedom. But so I was, that was a nice um, little history lesson. we weren't in the front though. I wish I was in the front because I'm not sure how great voice memo worked because somebody was in front of us talking quite a bit. So I don't know, we'll see how that goes. I think I should be able to, I also took notes at the same time. So I think I should be good between the two of them. So did you get what you needed, babe? I think I did. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to fly it as much as I can over there. And then it's really windy. The wind picks up here because you're right off the, the ocean. I don't so. fly the drone at all. That's completely his thing. See? Wait, I can't see. Oh, wow. You can't take it off yet, it's not right. Yeah. Yet. Fresh coconut yesterday. We did, we had a fresh coconut yesterday. One of the fruits, if you open it up before it's ready to harvest, is poisonous. Yes. I, I think it may be, maybe I can If you force sure. it open. A lot of information, they give you a lot of information about Wait, the Wait, I can't see you in there. You gotta make sure I can see. Even though it took the entirety of our day, it was worth it because I got to talk to a local and ask a lot of questions and I really like doing that, so. I'm gonna use my Wi-Fi to set my phone up. Um, I mean, my watch. I'm gonna use my watch to set my phone up and put on a self timer. And so I should be able to do that with my phone, but not so much my camera. Pray for your friend, because <laughs> I just like to lounge by the water and take a lot of pictures. I also told myself that I would start taking more horizontal videos so that I can include them in um, our vlogs. So that's what I'm doing, friends. It looks better this way. Oh, snorkeling, friends. Oh.
ready. I wanted Brian to coordinate, but he refused to. Um, That's not true. Collaborate. That's not true. Who was coordinating so, yesterday? We got a whole compliment. Love his outfit, but it doesn't coordinate with mine. But I'm in full Jamaica vibes right now. Love it. And my purse that's Savannah approved. And I even got this chain situation to go around my neck so that I don't lose my mask. So I'm waiting on him today. Just so you know. You're waiting. Just so it's documented. We um, spoke to one of the managers of the resort and told them that we were trying to um, document our stay. And um, he invited us to come over to another part or another resort on the property. So we're going to go over there and look around a bit. And hopefully we'll come back in the morning right before we leave um, to get a little bit of footage um, to show what that is like. So we're heading over there now. Then we're gonna go get some dinner. And we'll probably walk by the beach because it's our last night, friends. <laughs> Because that's what we do with our lives to secure our future for our family. We have meetings. Do you guys have family meetings? I feel like this has been really good because we normally have our normal family meetings, but this time it just gets to be the two of us, you know? So we can go back and relay the message to the kids and um, get into this thoughtful family. <laughs> right, babe? Oh my gosh. We talk about the family meeting, Brian. Yeah, this is my way. We could have walked through here, I told you. <laughs> Remember? I'm grateful for him because he helps me shake off my nerves and go for what God put in my heart. We help each other. We help each other. Help each other. <laughs> they have the most beautiful wedding spot. Look at this. It's gorgeous. <laughs> Like, how could you not want to get married here? And then the spot, right there. So this is where they host weddings. We just left there, and it's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> So now we are heading to get something to eat and to drink on our last night here in Jamaica. We feel like Jamaica is going to be our place now. The place that revived our dreams. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Brian says yes. And let's see if we can get some sunset going on. This spot is like our favorite place to be right where the mountains are behind us. I kept thinking where the mountain meets the moon. <laughs> you guys know that book. Ready to see your babies? I am. Tell them all the fun we had. <laughs> Kendall said he was jealous, so he's asking all the questions about when it's his turn. Cake or French toast. So I'm going to enjoy that. 
enjoy our last breakfast in Jamaica and our stuff is all packed and we are probably gonna walk on the beach for a little bit and then head off to the airport. Hopefully our ride to the airport isn't super late. I'm excited to get home. I cannot wait to see my babies and show them all the pictures and things like that. I miss them so very much, but we have been enjoying our time here in Jamaica. So. And eat now before my food is no longer. Ready.